The Mathematics Department has always been a stimulating, innovative and challenging environment for students in this school. We have a conscientious teaching team who embrace mixed ability teaching and who work hard to enable all students to reach their potential. We recognise the importance of tailoring our teaching to the needs of all of our students and acknowledge the great demands that this places on us as teachers. As a team we are committed to trying out new ideas that encourage skills such as communication, problem solving and analytical thinking. The study of mathematics is indeed a life skill, but we also need to demonstrate that it is a powerful and at times beautiful subject in its own right. For our most enthusiastic students in all years, we have a regular maths competition called the Challenger, where students try to solve complex mathematical problems. We also enter students who have a genuine interest in the subject for the National UKMT Maths Challenges, which are held annually and incorporate both team and individual events. We also organise other events outside of school, which we open to all interested students, and we celebrate success by awarding prizes and recognising achievements in our success wall in the maths area. In the school library, we have an interesting selection of mathematical books and magazines designed to stimulate mathematical thinking and introduce students to ideas that they may not have seen before. Mathematics is taught in all ability tutor groups during years 7, 8 and 9 and the team work hard to ensure that differentiation takes place to meet the diversity of learning ability. Our schemes of work are always being developed in light of new initiatives but consistently focused on the key process skills within mathematics so that students can use and apply their skills to solve problems both out of context and in everyday situations. Teaching units within each year vary in length depending upon the complexity of the topics covered and are usually based on objectives from number, algebra, geometry and statistics. We integrate opportunities in class for recapping previous work and have regular formative assessments so that students can check their levels of understanding. The Learning Support Department continue to play an important role in trying to raise the performance of all of our students and we really appreciate their help inside the classroom, particularly with those students who struggle with mathematics. We have our own maths teaching assistant who predominantly works with small groups of students in year 7 and 8 who need more support in their mathematics. The focus is on building up essential numeracy skills and establishing good positive working relationships. We find that this builds up confidence levels and students are then more prepared for their regular lessons. Although we try to avoid setting students for as long as possible, we do start to broadly band our students in Year 10 into two tiers, Foundation and Higher, to cope with the demands of the GCSE course. This is done on teacher recommendations following their performance during Key Stage 3, so that each student has the opportunity to realise their potential. As in Key Stage 3, we use a range of resources and activities to engage the students, encouraging them to work together and think about different ways of approaching problems. The department has a range of textbooks and worksheets which enable us to set work appropriate to each tier and also to prepare students for the exams. We currently follow the AQA linear specification which has three examination papers that are equally weighted and which are taken by the students in the May-June examination session of Year 11. Each paper is one hour and 30 minutes long and for paper one only, no calculator is allowed. We do not use a set textbook in any year group, but instead have a range of books that complement our own worksheets and other resources. As a team, we like to focus on activities that promote discussion and encourage the students to work together. We also have digital projectors inside classrooms and are constantly looking to use ICT where appropriate to enhance our teaching. To support students with their independent learning, we have an annual subscription to online maths learning platforms, MathsWatch and MyMaths, both of which should be helpful for consolidating work covered in lessons and when revising for exams. Most importantly, it can be used by students both in school and at home. In the sixth form, mathematics and further mathematics courses are offered to students at both AS and A level, provided that they have secured the right grade at GCSE. They will need a grade 6 to do mathematics and grade 7 to do further mathematics in post 16. Both courses require a serious commitment from the students and they need to be prepared to do a lot of work in their own time to consolidate new topics covered in class. In years 12 and 13, students follow the AQA specification and are expected to study pure maths, mechanics and statistics. Further maths students also study aspects of discrete mathematics. 
Exams are taken in the May-June period each year. Graphic calculators and textbooks are available to all students for the duration of the course, and students also have access to an online package called Integral to support their own independent learning. If you have any further questions, please contact me, Adrian Daly, Head of Maths at the school, and the email address shown on the screen.